you know, activating one's superpowers is not always so enchanting. To really understand power and the cosmic source of it is to be a beacon for goodness, is to be a beacon for love. You can't go to the higher frequencies if you're thinking that there's a bad guy or that you got to kill someone to protect that person. Nah. It's like state of mind. And that state of mind we all have access to. It's very connected to our breathing. It's connected to our intention. And it's about presence. It's about allowing presence to be in you without your mind telling it not in so many ways. So the mind needs to be stilled. And that's why meditation is so important. And that's why being by yourself, stilling your mind, stopping all of the other minds that are always, yep, 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 yep. Holy shit. So much talk, 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 right? Drives you freaking crazy. You got to get silent. You got to get quiet. And you got to get to a point where nothing matters. There's no problemos. It's all outside in some other world. You're, there's a place inside of you that is like secure, safe, and then just fill it with love. Just, just love yourself. Keep sending you vibes around your own love and keep that as your base. And know that when you're around people who don't love you and don't care about you, but pr pretend they do, Eh, no more of that. You can sense that. Get rid of them. Be around people who you love and you love them. You know, that's the baseline for everything, right? And you got to understand what love is. And love is, is a true sense of you're not trying to possess this person. You're not trying to do anything. You're just appreciating their presence. You're appreciating their conscious awareness that they have taken time to be with you and they like being with you. That's an amazing freaking thing, you know? So many beautiful things you can put your attention upon in your own life. If you actually put your attention upon someone else and you're not just trying to get something from them, but you actually just want to appreciate them, be with them, enjoy them. You know, that's the essence of being a human. It's friendship camaraderie, connection. It's what all humans want. It's what we love. And now they're trying to frick with that. They're trying to stop even that. It's like they fuck with the money system. They fuck with the indigenous people. They fuck with, you know, the, the, the fucking chemtrails. You know, now they're putting in this 5G surveillance network that's going around the entire planet. And that's the horror show that they don't want the world's attention upon. So they're doing all this COVID stuff. And it doesn't really matter one way or the other what happens, right? You're just trying to herd these cows into those little fences and you're seeing which ones go in and which ones don't. And you're wondering which ones you, at some point, you're going to need the prod with, right? And we're in the place where they're just moving people about but they know they can't actually do it unless we agree to it as soon as the herd goes mm, uh, we don't like this but the herd's got to wake up 
And the herd is everybody. The herd, the, the herd is humanity. And every individual has to become the Jedi Knight. Every individual has to become the Jesus Christ. Every individual has to become their highest aspect of God. Every individual is a source of superhero power. And now we're in a situation where we actually need to use our combined intelligence to do something about what's occurring. Because if we don't, it's gonna get way worse. Like, do you get that? Do you really get that? Because if you don't get that, you know, you're missing the old get it. It's like now. 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 We control the media. We are the media. Learn how to think for yourself. Learn how to see the world the way you want to see it. And stop letting these DNA junkies try to fuck with your flow, man. Stop that.